State Standards Math 7th Grade Expressions and Equations 1 and 2, Algebra 1B, and we're factoring linear equations. It's supposed to be a linear equation, so it didn't show up. Anyways, um, this is, um, factoring means uh, like when you have a product of two, um, product of factors, any, it's what's in common to both terms. And so we're going to factor out what's common to both terms. And if we have 4x and 12x on number 1, well, uh, we have the factor of 4 in both of them. So we can pull a 4 out. That's common to both. So factoring is common to both. And we can also pull uh, an x out. So what's common to both is uh, 4x. Okay, and that's as far as you can go on um, that so far. And number two, uh, what can we pull out of what's common to both? Well, uh, we know that 2 goes into 18 and 2 goes into 20. So we, it's common is 2, a factor of 2 is common. And also, A is common to both because we have 18A and 20AB. But B is not common, and as, as that's as far as you can go. So the... It's kind of like the GCF. Anyways, the third one, well, 12 is common to both. 12 goes into 36, so 12 is common to both. And we have a C in both, and we have a D in both. So you can factor out a 12 C and D. So let's move on to a little bit more. Uh, let's go back here with uh, an example four. And it wants you to factor 3x plus 9. Not just two terms, but they want you to, exp uh, to factor this expression. Uh, so what is common to both terms? Well, we know 3x is a term, and we know 9 is a term. And what is common to both? Well, it would be 3. So it would be 3, and we are left with x plus 3. It's kind of undoing distributive, so it looks like distributive in the end. So let's check that out. So 3 times x is 3x, and 3 times 3 is plus 9. So you're undoing what we just learned how to do. So therefore, it's a check. If you can f go back and forth in math, you have to go back and forth. Let's try another one, number 5 here. Let's factor 12x plus 7y. And let's see, uh, is there anything common that in 12 and 7? No. So you can't take any kind of constant uh, coefficient. And x and y are not com common, so it can't be factored. So there are no factors, so no factors. If you can't, if there are no factors that are common, you can't factor it. You cannot factor that. Uh, so let's do another one. Uh, 6 here. 4x minus 28. And what they want you to factor out what's common to both terms. And let's see. Well, I can take a 4 out of both of them, can't I? And because uh, 4 goes into 4 and 4 goes into 28 seven times. So let's take a 4 out. So 4. And there's no x. So we're left with x minus 7. Because if I take a factor of 4, I get 1, and a factor of 4 out of here, I get 7, and it's negative 7. And so that's as far as you can go. And to prove that, you can go 4 times x is 4x, and 4 times negative 7 is negative 28. Sure enough, you get the same answer. Thank you.